what is up youtube what is up facebook it is your boy jimmy jams back in the house today we got some news on ar abs we got some news on rowdy rebel bobby smurder little yachty plus a ton more look guys we're only 200 subscribers away from being monetized here on jams tv clips so make sure you tell a couple friends to subscribe to the channel when we hit that thousand mark we are giving away some money a hundred dollars cash to one lucky winner here when we hit a thousand okay so make sure y'all give this video a like ring that bell if you haven't yet and tell a couple friends share the video so anyway ar abs he got locked up a little while back you know, he's been in jail ever since, you know, these indictments came down on him. So anyway, he ended up getting stabbed by a crazy Sully. Okay. So apparently he had a cellmate that had some mental illnesses and the guy went crazy and ended up cutting AR apps. Okay. So not only that, but he's, you know, of course he's saying he's being mistreated in the prison facilities. His brother, um, which has a name, I think his name is, uh, lick moss okay which is a crazy name you know can't make this stuff up he was on queen's flip yesterday and he was talking about the condition of his brother he said he did say he had one brother and a cousin that is in there locked up with uh ar abs but he says that you know they're looking out for him and they're taking care of him but his condition is deteriorating he's in really bad health he said both his legs are swollen he can't walk. He believes that he his blood is infected because he has these sores, these lesions on his body that are bleeding like pus and things like this. And his brother believes this is the infection trying to work its way out of his blood and it's coming through his skin and causing these sores. So they're saying he's in real bad condition. He ain't been able to get out of bed in the last couple of weeks because of his legs are swollen. He don't know if it's diabetes or what it is. But apparently he's not getting the proper proper medical attention that you know a human being deserves when you're incarcerated. It ain't like you can go, well, I don't feel good. Let me go to the doctor. That ain't how it works in the prison system. You got to put it in requests. There's all these inmates before you, and you can damn near die before you see a doctor. So his brother was saying that they've been in there going in there changing his sheets like seven, eight times a day from the blood. That is pouring out these sores on his body and he's saying that his brother is turned like not black as in you know like uh brown skinned people but around the lesions are turning a dark black so he says they're all over him he, he's completely like dark black his legs are swelled up can't get out of bed done been stabbed by the celly okay the celly got moved to a psych ward because apparently he was in there with somebody that was crazy. Now his lawyers are motioning the court for help. Okay. To get him to the doctors and things he needs like that. But there's some types because he has two lawyers. He has a trial lawyer and he has a, a appeals lawyer or something of that nature. And these two lawyers are in communication, but it's delaying the process. And in that delay, um, AR abs is sitting up in the prison messed up. Now they do believe he had some medical conditions before he went to prison, but they have worsened like severely with the mistreatment and, you know, people not taking care of him, his medical issues off the bat that his health is deteriorating. So that's really sad news coming out about that. You know what I'm saying? So we're hoping him the best and hopefully these prison systems, man, they mistreat people every day.